All right, Assassin's Creed is back again. They can't, man, they can't keep quiet whatsoever, I see here. They can't keep quiet, Assassin's Creed. Uh, so this is another exclusive from Insider, Game, uh, Insider Gaming. Uh, I know we talked about already with Assassin's Creed uh, on why it's delayed and and they're, they're one of the reasons why, one of the reasons why it's, it was delayed because they want to get the accuracy of the of the Japanese culture correct, which is kind of weird because Assassin's Creed has always been known for getting like the environmental, um, uh, the environmental accuracy, the historical environmental accuracy correct. Obviously, the characters that they pick. They will make it up and, and stuff like that. Uh, but like, but the, the environment, the settings are, have always been like as, as accurate as possible. So it was very shocking to see um, how this game was not doing that. And this game was like, like they were not doing their homework whatsoever. And, or they, and, and like, 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 like the people, the historians came late to the project. Things were rushed. And, you know, besides having bugs and, and uh um not running properly and everything like that uh which is sadly a lot of the norm with uh, with ubisoft games uh if you t if you ask some people who play ubisoft games they're like oh yeah the game's always buggy on the first day but that it'll be fine like a couple weeks especially when the game goes on sale or something like that you know um but usually with assassin's creed games like I said, the historical side of things of like the environment or the weapons used or someone's like how someone will act towards like a certain like someone like like how someone will, will like react to like a samurai like or a certain general like, you know, the how, or if they see like a pirate, for example, like how what people will normally have like act like how people would normally act it and everything. They get that that information correct. So. That was, that was the reason why they, one of the reasons why they delayed the game. And also they want to, you know, iron it out and everything. But it seems like as well, they're, they're trying to make it up to us by uh, adding in a co-op mode is uh, in development. Now, it's the, the co-op mode's in development. How do you have time for this? You have, you have to make sure, I don't, I don't want to hear any features until this game is corrected and the best that it can be, but now you're throwing in co-op mode. So Assassin's Creed is currently, uh, currently has a co-op mode in development, uh, which is in schedule to release post launch. The new co-op mode, uh, code name league is under development at Ubisoft, but doesn't, uh, doesn't have a set release date due to the game's recent post postponement. Um, I just, I just I thought it was, I just thought it was something, but I will uh, I'll, I'll address it. Which affecting which is affecting the entire uh, Assassin's Creed uh, Assassin's Creed pipeline. However, sources tell me that League was in development long before the postponement. Okay, and and that it and this wasn't an addition because of the delay. Okay, um, so before anyone speculates anything like that, um, now I'm just wondering. If Assassin's Creed was planning on coming out November, like was this scheduled? Was this scheduled to? Uh, was this scheduled to to um, come out in November? You know, so that's what I want to know. Uh, while uh, while specific uh, while specific details on on what. And what the game mode actually entails are slim. Simply, the uh, co-op mode will see uh, Neo and Yasuke fighting side by side using the different combat abilities to take enemies out. We'll, we'll take out enemies. I just sorry, I word that differently. That that isn't uh, that is the only multiplayer Assassin's Creed experience to hit players' hands within the uh, next eighteen months. Either it's uh, understood that. Uh, that Assassin's Creed Invictus is fully fledged multiplayer experience will come in 2025. Why? Okay, you know, for a while, <laughs> I've been saying for a long time that Ubisoft. Let's just make, especially now, that like you have so many assassins. How many assassins are there in total? In the, in all of uh. How many assassins? 
uh, in Assassin's Creed series. Like, how many assassins are there? I need a, I need like a list. Do we, have, do we have like a list of names? Of assassins? How many assassins? Wow. Thanks, Google. There are many. Obviously. I know there's many. I want to know how many assassins are there. All right, meet the assassins of Assassin's Creed. One, two, three. You even have like the people who taught them. Four, like Heyman. Those like uh like Kenway from the third one. Five. Edward James Kenway. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten, okay. All right, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, uh, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. That could be like a skin swap. Eighteen, and then, oh, twenty. I will say that's the, roughly around twenty. Can we not have an Assassin's Creed fighting game? Like a Soul Calibur style Assassin's Creed fighting game. Can we not do that? That's what I've been saying for the longest time. Why not make an Assassin's Creed fighting game? I think it's time. Yeah, well, you have all the right assassins. You know, and then if you want, you can add in different add in different assassins later on. You know, I think that would be sick. That needs to happen. I've been saying that forever. Make that the next, make that the next one. Uh, the article continues. Other Assassin's Creed games in development include the Assassin's Creed. They're making, they're remaking Black Flag. Is that actually a thing? Under the code name Obsidian and, and the code name Hexy, which is, which has been described as the, as the, the darkest Assassin's Creed to date. video here let's check it out wait, wait a minute long. assassin's creed shadows has a co-op mode in development and it's scheduled to release post-launch how's it going everyone mike straw senior editor here and insider gaming has learned that the new co-op game mode codename codenamed league is under development currently at ubisoft that said it doesn't have a set release date due to the game's recent delay affecting the entire assassin's creed pipeline while specific details on what the game mode actually entails are slim Presumably, the co-op mode will see Naue and Yasuke fight side by side using their different combat abilities to take out enemies. And this new co-op mode isn't going to be the only multiplayer Assassin's Creed experience to hit players' hands within the next 18 months. It's understood that Assassin's Creed Invictus, a fully-fledged multiplayer experience akin to the likes of Fall Guys, will come sometime in 2025. What? Hold on come sometime in 2025 and within the next 18 months. It's understood that Assassin's Creed Invictus, a fully fledged multiplayer experience akin to the likes of Fall Guys, will could it be like Fall Guys? Will come sometime in 2025. Okay. <laughs> Other Assassin's Creed games in development include an Assassin's Creed Black Flag remake under the codename Obsidian and codename Hexa, which has been described as the darkest Assassin's Creed to date. Earlier this week, Insider Gaming also reported on behind the scenes details on what actually happened with the Assassin's Creed Shadows delay, and you can get that information in the description below. Yeah, we already we already got that. Uh we already we already seen that. Um well, all right. Why can you not just make like I said, come up with an Assassin's Creed fighting game? Like a Soul Calibur style. If we're not gonna get another Soul Calibur again, you be the Soul Calibur replacement then. You have all the right people. I think it'll be sick. You have different environments. You have the animus in the background. You know, you can even have main like main characters from like the first three Assassin's Creed games in there. I think it'd be sick. They can they can do that. You have like the people you interact with. Like, um, wait, I wonder. 
Yeah, there's not. I realized the list I looked at before didn't have the up to date one because they didn't have um, the guy from Mirage. Anyway, um, it's in, it's cool that they're coming with a new mode. It's interesting that there's no release date for it, especially if it's already if it was already in development and then it was supposed to be ready for uh, around like the post launch of November. You will you'll think you'll be ready for when the game is at launch because the game is delayed but things are pushed back i don't do development i can't say anything about that so um yeah i guess you know like like they mentioned it wasn't something that it is like oh yeah we're gonna lump this in now to make you guys feel better as long like i really hope they get this game right and you're not gonna make everyone happy um as long i just want a good game i know a lot of people they're not as excited for assassin's creed uh shadows as they should be because this is something that they want and even before um ghosts of uh yotai or yote has been announced people were they they weren't and even before like I don't know. People, it didn't seem like people were that excited for it. So hopefully, hopefully some minds are changed. Hopefully, some things are shown to change their mind. Um, now I'm wondering even when they will show off Assassin's Creed. Like, will they have like a press event before or after the Game Awards? Like the week of the Game Awards? That's probably the, that's probably the next best opportunity to get. Uh, get your game out there to publicists. Maybe show a trailer at the Game Awards, and then that that weekend have like a press event at the Game Awards. That'd be nice. I'm not just saying that because I'm planning to go to Game Awards, but it would be nice. That just that just seems like the next major thing, you know, get people's minds back into it, you know. So, um. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. Let me know if you're planning on to like, what's your hype level? I guess with with Assassin's Creed and uh, uh, Shadows, and if this mode gets you excited. I know they had they had like a co-op mode before, right? That was one. That's one with the twins. I'm wondering how this one's even gonna work, to be honest. So, but I want an Assassin's Creed Soul Calibur style of game. Come on, get in the fighting game world, Ubisoft. Come on, give me what I want. <laughs> it will help you out. Trust me.